Hi, I'm James Zock from the NAY Essex. I part own Keystroke with GG Thoroughbred Racing. For anyone looking to get involved in syndicate racing, go to www.innerpaddock.co.uk. Go and check them out. Horse racing has always been a big part of my life. I've been very passionate about it since I was a young boy. I always loved horse racing. Um, it's always been a great day out, going to Ascot, Newmarket, all the big meets. It's just something I've always enjoyed, you know? And it's, it's the buzz, the atmosphere when you go into the races. The most exciting part of owning a racehorse is the whole, the buzz of it, you know? It, it adds, it adds to the excitement, the potential of your horse winning. You know, nothing can, nothing can beat that. You know, and when Keystrokes won a few races, the buzz of it, the adrenaline run, rush rather, is, is second to none. We're all going Saturday, can't wait for it, buzzing for it. So if it comes in, big party on Saturday. I'm very happy with him, obviously he's an outsider on Saturday, but we've had a very good preparation with him this time. We've got Adam Kirby on board again. I'm very hopeful that Ascot will suit him. And um, you know, it's great to be going to Ascot with this sort of horse in a, in a race where you know, we're taking on some of the best sprinters in the world. It allows people to get in involved in racing at an affordable amount of money. Um, and you, it's, you don't just get the chance to own one racehorse, which, you know, with whole ownership, you may only be able to afford that. You get to own little parts of maybe three horses. So, you know, you get more action, more excitement, more days out of the racing. That's what syndicates allow you to do, get involved at a fraction of the cost. To be a Royal Ascot winner, as an owner, for me, is something I never, really contemplated, you know, it's not something you think about. Um, up until a few years ago, owning a racehorse wasn't something I thought about. Now that I'm in it, it's something achievable, believable, you know, it was, you know, I can't describe it in words, but I'll be buzzing for it. I can't wait.